In this audit, we assessed if the Department of Families, Fairness and Housing, or the Department, has adequate controls to make sure that child protection data in its Client Relationship Information System, or CRIS, is reliable. We examined if the Department manages child protection data in line with the Government's data quality standards. We also examined if its controls make sure that child protection data is complete, accurate and recorded in a timely way. We found that the Department doesn't have effective controls to make sure its child protection data is high quality. We found examples of incomplete, inaccurate and inconsistent data in CRIS. This is because the Department doesn't comply with the Government's data quality standards, CRIS isn't fit for purpose and its controls don't always work, and staff who use CRIS have heavy workloads which reduces the time they have to correctly record information. This means the department may not have easy access to high quality data to make decisions about vulnerable children and monitor children's progress in care. The department told us it's aware of these issues and is working on a plan to fix them. The department is responsible for child protection in Victoria. CRIS is the main system it uses to store information about children in its care. For example, CRIS stores children's personal details, including their address and their progress in school. It also records decisions about their support and well-being, including checks to make sure they're being cared for in a safe home. The department needs to make sure that CRIS data is high quality so it can fulfil its obligations to vulnerable children and support its policies and decisions. We found that CRIS isn't fit for purpose and some of its data quality controls aren't effective. For example, CRIS has controls to make sure users fill mandatory data fields, but we found they're not always filled. This leaves gaps in the data. Some of the data in CRIS we looked at was incomplete, inaccurate and inconsistent. For example, we found 462 children didn't have their address recorded. 19% of children didn't have their disability status recorded. Of the children that did have a disability recorded, 32% of files didn't say the type of disability, and there were 437 more children recorded in the department's carer payment system than in CRIS. These gaps mean that the department can't make informed decisions that are in the best interests of vulnerable children. There are many reasons why the department's child protection data is poor quality, including CRIS is a legacy system that hasn't kept up with technology and sector changes, the department doesn't comply with the government's data quality standards, and staff don't have time to enter information in CRIS due to their heavy workloads. We made three recommendations to the department about strengthening its controls to improve the quality of child protection data. To find out more, or to read our full report, go to audit.vic.gov.au.